Hi, I'm Margaret from Warm and Fuzzy Soapery, and today I'm talking packaging. When we first started our soaping journey, we hadn't given packaging a single thought. I started making soap because of my daughter's eczema, and I didn't really think about selling it. After a while, as anyone who makes soap can tell you, we had more soap than we knew what to do with. So we started giving it away. We gave it to family members, we gave it to friends, we gave it to coworkers, and we donated quite a bit. We still donate quite a bit. When we started getting feedback from people saying that they bought a soap at a local farmer's market and that ours was just as good or sometimes better, we started thinking that maybe we should be selling our soap. Then we started looking at packaging options and we were overwhelmed. Some soapers don't wrap their so soap at all. Some go way over the top. Some use cigar bands, some use cellophane, some use boxes. So what was right for our brand? We decided in the beginning to use cellophane. It protects the soap, it seals in the scent, it keeps it dry, and it's relatively inexpensive. But we also noticed that it's not the best for the environment. Even though we were using biodegradable cellophane, we wanted to make the switch to something nicer. So we contacted a few printing places and got some samples. They were fantastic. We got samples of all different types of paper. We picked out the paper we wanted to use, we sent them our logo, and we waited for a price. The sticker shock really bumped me out. The paper we liked with our logo was so expensive. Well, if you break it down by each bar of soap, it really wasn't that expensive, but you had to buy so much of it to start that it was really out of reach for us for the moment. It was an initial investment of somewhere like $700 to $1,400. And then one day we were shopping at Restaurant Depot and I realized they sold the same deli paper that we liked in rolls and for only $9.95 for an entire roll. So my husband came up with an idea. We bought the roll of deli paper and decided to use our soap stamp to get the look of the pre-printed paper that the printing company was offering. And guess what? It's amazing. We are so happy with the way our soap looks now. Is it time consuming? Yes. Is it tedious to make? Yes. Did I save myself over $700? You bet I did. At first, I thought about keeping this information to myself. I mean, I want my soap to have the best looking packaging out there, but so many people have asked me about it. And honestly, the soaping community is so helpful that we decided to make a video showing just how easy it is to make this wrapping paper. I hope this video helps some of you out. Let's get started. So this is the roll of paper. I put it on a roller to make it easier to handle. So I just pull out a length of paper and tear it off. And this is what the paper looks like on the side. There's a lot of paper here. After I cut out a few sheets of paper, my husband gets out our stamps and he puts the stamps all over the paper in a pattern that he likes. The first time I saw him doing this, I thought he was crazy. He was getting the ink all over my table and I didn't think it would come off so easily. As you can see here, the ink comes off the table really quite easily. When he's finished stamping the paper, he gives it to me and then I use this cutter that I got from Michaels to cut the paper down into seven by six inch rectangles. That is what we determined is the best size to cut it for our particular bars of soap. 
and the ruler on the top of the cutter really makes it easy to make accurate cuts. I also save the pieces on the end that are too small to wrap an actual bar of soap and we use those to wrap our samples with. So that's it. That's how we make the packaging for our soap. And here is me wrapping some soap. I hope this video was helpful and I'd love to see how some of you make your own packaging. So please tag us in our Instagram, our Facebook posts, tag us on TikTok, mention us anywhere, and uh, I'd love to see it. I know your time is important to you, so thanks for spending it watching this video. If you enjoyed it, hit the like button and share it with a friend, and subscribe to see more videos like this. And remember, life is short. Use the good soap.